So I just finished a YouTube video where someone was using their new DJI Mic 2 connected to their computer. And when I first clicked on the video, I thought, oh, that's cool. It can connect to your computer over USB. But actually, they were connecting the DJI Mic 2 over Bluetooth. And then I thought, wait a minute, my iPhone has Bluetooth. Does that mean that I can connect the DJI Mic 2 to my iPhone? And sure enough, here we are. You're listening to the audio right now being wirelessly transmitted over Bluetooth from the DJI Mic 2 to my iPhone 15 Pro. I'm recording this on the Blackmagic camera app. To get things set up, you hold down the link button on the DJI mic, put it into pairing mode, then you select it from your Bluetooth settings on your iPhone, and then it appears as an option for an audio source in the Blackmagic camera app. And that's how this audio is coming in right now. So let's do a little comparison. Let's compare the audio that's being transmitted over Bluetooth and being recorded directly in my iPhone 15 Pro with the audio that's recorded internally, the 32-bit float audio recorded internally in the DJI Mic 2. Okay, so now you can see we've got the record light on on the DJI Mic 2 and the audio that you're hearing was copied from this transmitter into my computer and I dubbed it over the iPhone footage. How does it sound in comparison to the Bluetooth audio that you heard just a minute ago? Okay, so I've turned off the DJI mic and now you are listening to the audio from my AirPods Pro 2. This is the Lightning version, not the new USB-C version, but that's going into the iPhone 15 Pro being recorded in the Blackmagic app. How does this sound compared to the audio from the DJI mic? Okay, just a couple thoughts to kind of wrap things up. Yeah, maybe the Bluetooth transmitted audio doesn't sound quite as good as the internally recorded 32-bit float, but it's way better than AirPods audio, better than like the audio built into the iPhone itself, especially when, you know, it's six feet away from me like it is now. So all in all, I think uh, this is awesome. It's gonna be really cool when they actually fully release this DJI mic too, so we can learn about some of the other features because I know some of the content creators who created the Osmo Pocket 3 videos, they they seem to kind of hedge and they were worried about, you know, what can we actually say about this DJI mic? So it's obvious that, uh, you know, DJI is gonna do like a full release of this DJI mic 2 at some point, and then we'll get to really learn like all of the features that it can do. But for now, I hope you found this video interesting. Uh, it's cool that it can do Bluetooth to your phone. Maybe you don't even need the Pocket 3. If you already have a phone, once they start selling these transmitters individually, just pick one of these up and that's pretty much it. I'll see you in the next video.